My Whirlpool washer stopped mid-cycle and the rinse light was blinking. The clothes that were in it were soaking wet. I've tried unplugging slash replugging and it sits on the rinse cycle blinking not doing anything. What happened just before the light on your Whirlpool washer came on? Nothing, it literally just stopped as if it was paused on rinse. I've tried a few different things to try and reset it and nothing works. How long has this been going on with your Whirlpool washer? What have you tried so far? Just started this afternoon. We just got these in November and just started using them in February. Brand new. I've tried resetting by turning the knob like it tells you, and it goes through all of the cycles super quick, but it definitely makes a weird sound when it's supposed to agitate and or spin. I think the motor just needs to be reset, but I don't know how to do that. Anything else we should know to help you best? That's it. Welcome to Just Answer. My name is M. Sar. You are having problems with your appliance. I will do my best to help you get this resolved as soon as possible. I know it's frustrating to have an appliance that doesn't work or doesn't work properly. Is this a top or front load washer? Top load. Please provide the model number off of the washer. This is usually located by opening the washer lid and looking for a model and serial number sticker under the lid, not on the lid, on the cabinet. Sometimes this is at the very back of the cabinet under the lid and hard to see. A readable photo of the model slash serial number sticker would be great. Customer attachment June 26, 2024, 35 and 29 seconds a.m. WTW 4855HW1, for my reference, perfect. Thanks. So you can get it to run but it makes an unusual noise? Well, it would run, then stop at the rinse cycle, and the light would blink and the lid would be locked. When I messed around with it and got it unlocked, I took the sopping wet clothes out of the washer and tried to start a cycle with it empty and it does the same thing. It makes a buzzing noise when it's supposed to spin or agitate so I don't know if the motor needs to be reset because the load before made it off balance or what, but it wasn't a big load. I tried the whole lift the lid 6 times in 12 seconds, 30 seconds after you unplug it and it now doesn't turn on, so I currently have it unplugged hoping it will turn on in the morning. Do you want to try to repair it yourself since it is still under the one-year manufacturer warranty or do you want to call for warranty service? Probably call for warranty service. But if you think it's an easy fix, I can try it myself. These machines had a problem with the gearbox pulley coming loose on the bottom and it will cause the belt to be out of place and eventually come off. When the pulley gets loose the clutch starts slipping and making an unusual noise. You could move the washer out from the wall and tip it back resting it on the wall and get underneath the machine to inspect. There is a guard under there that takes a 5 16 of an inch socket or nut driver to remove. You could remove that and check and see if the nut on the pulley has came loose. If you don't want to do all that or you don't find anything. Please call Whirlpool customer service slash warranty at dash to submit a warranty service request. Thank you for using Just Answer. I hope I was able to answer your question to your satisfaction. If you need to follow up on this question, please use the reply button. Thanks again, and have a great weekend. Daryl if you have a home improvement or appliance question and want to chat with an expert now visit justanswer.com slash YTHI.